Wisconsin's lakes and waterways are teeming with many varieties of fish. In this short video, we'll visit with fish expert John Lyons from the Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources and learn about some of the most interesting fish in the Wisconsin River. This fish is the common carp. The common carp is not native to Wisconsin. It was brought over in about the 1880s and 1890s, and at the time it was thought that it was going to be a great addition to Wisconsin's fish fauna. And so it was brought over to Wisconsin with the same idea in mind, that it would add something to the fish fauna and the fishery of the state. Carp found Wisconsin very much to their liking, and after being introduced, they quickly spread and became quite common. The problem was, here in Wisconsin, they reached really high levels and started to ca cause all sorts of problems with the ecosystems that they inhabited. Carp feed by sucking the vegetation and the silt off the bottom and filtering it through their mouth. And so by pulling up the vegetation, by stirring up the bottom, they created conditions that were not good for the survival of the native game fish, and they often created algae blooms in the lake. They removed the vegetation that the native fish used for spawning and for hiding places, I mean, to the point that many lakes were dominated with 99% of, of the fish flesh present in the lake being composed of common carp. So not long after the carp became established in Wisconsin, the state began efforts to try to eliminate or at least reduce carp and they've been at them ever since. Over the years we have captured and removed millions and millions of pounds of carp and in some cases it seems to have helped but by and large it's been an ongoing battle with some successes and some failures and despite all of our efforts carp are going to be here to stay and it seems unlikely that we'll ever get rid of them from the state. 